One of the most frustrating things is getting bombarded by cold emails and cold calls, selling me on technology that is just way too complicated and expensive to use. Yet, without technology, we would not be able to survive the new normal through this whole pandemic. And which is the reason why today I'll be introducing you to QR codes, something that is simple to use and to allow you to digitalize your menu. And not only that, how do you market properly using QR codes? Make sure you guys keep watching. Hello friends, my name is Wilson, your friend in helping you build a profitable restaurant. Just want to give a major shout out to these two individuals for their support. And that's the community that I want to be able to nourish and to create. So if you do want to be able to get featured, make sure you go in the comment section below and leave a question behind or simply just show some love. Now without further ado, let's dive right in. So to start off, what is a QR code? QR code stands for quick response code. Now, how does it work? You simply get your phone or smart device to take a picture of this barcode and afterwards automatically on your phone, it would generate either a menu, a discount, a PDF, whatever you want to be able to set up on the back end to show your customers. So your customers would be able to just pull that up and see exactly what you want to show them. The first use of this whole QR code is to modernize your menu. Menu is one of the highest touch point in a restaurant environment, oftentimes getting past hundreds of times a day. And that's the reason why you would see this huge trend in changing menu into a digital version through QR codes. So simply put, you would have a QR code that is generated and then you would have it on the table stuck or it would be on the flyer by the window and then simply people come in, they scan the QR code and then the menu pops up on their phone. Now the beauty of using this QR code is not only on the hygienic factor but then also you would allow your customers to see different types of menus at different times of the days. So for example, if you're serving brunch and when they come in and when they scan the QR code, automatically it shows them the brunch menu. Whereas when someone comes in during the happy hour time, you would show them a different menu throughout the same QR code. And the technology allows you to set this up properly so then that way all you have to do is to scan and you'd be ready to see multiple different menus. As an operator of the restaurant, it is also a huge benefit for you. Not only does it save you money in printing daily special menus, but then also as you have different specials and as you have different menu items, you can easily go into the back end and simply just update the menu so then that way it reflects properly. It also saves you a ton of money in printing new versions of the menu every single time you make an update. And just when you think that you should wait a little and maybe wait out the whole pandemic, well, according to Q Restaurant, more than 52% of restaurants in the United States has already transitioned from traditional menus into QR codes to stop the spread of the virus. And just when you think that this video ends right here, you are completely wrong because as Wilson's fashion, we go in depth how are you gonna be able to utilize this whole QR code technology? For one, you can actually get more reviews. According to a study conducted by UC Berkeley, a half star rating, only half star rating on either your Yelp, Google reviews, or Facebook reviews would allow you to have more than 30 to 40% uplift in your 7 p.m. bookings. What does that mean? That means thousands of dollars in your pocket per month with only half a star ranking. Now you might be asking, well, how do I utilize QR codes to get more reviews? Well, you can actually put it on a tent card, for example, at the table of your patrons. And when they're done their food, you can advise the waitress, waiters to tell them to, hey, you know what, if you enjoy the experience, feel free to leave us a review, scan the QR code. That's one way of using it, maybe leaving it at the cashier up front, allowing them to actually scan the QR code and automatically drives them to the website and the review platform of your choice. And because of this convenience, they're gonna be much more likely to leave you a review instead of having them go on the review site and search up your name and then type the review, automatically a scan, it goes straight to the review platform. By you reducing the friction, it allows you to have even more reviews. And a bonus tip for you is that you can actually have your QR codes printed on stickers and stick it to your delivery boxes. 
So when the delivery gets delivered to your customers, they can automatically scan it and leave you a review. Another way to utilize QR codes is to drive them to your social media handles. Depending on your objective, whether you want people to scan it for menu or to leave your reviews or to actually follow you on Instagram. So then that way you can have them as your customers and to market to them whenever you want to. And that's the reason why one of the bars in Vancouver has been able to execute it in great fashion. Basically what they've done is to have the QR code linked to their Instagram and created a campaign on their Instagram. So it just became such an easy way for people to actually access the restaurant's Instagram account simply by getting up their phone and scanning the code and automatically it drives to their Instagram so then that way they can easily follow them. A lot of times people do not take action because they're just lazy or it's just there's too much friction. They would do it later. How many times have we thought about, oh, I love this account, I love this restaurant, I wanna add them on Instagram, I wanna see what they do. And all of a sudden you need to go to the washroom or your other half, your partner is telling you a crazy story and it just, completely diverts your attention. And you just simply forget. By you having a QR code that leads to your social media, it becomes a seamless transaction. It's just like, take out the phone, scan, and automatically drives to your Instagram, Facebook profile, or any type of profile. All you have to do is click, follow, and boom, you already did the job. And that's the reason why having QR codes is so essential for marketing in today's age. Now you might be thinking, well, why would I want people to go on my Instagram? Why are restaurants investing so much money into marketing on Instagram as well? It is because of user generated content. What does that mean? It is when your friends and your family goes to dinner, takes out their phone and showcases the beautiful food and spread amongst them. The environment, the experiences that they have, and then they share it on their Instagram, share it on their Facebook, and by them doing that, you are much more influenced by these user-generated content. And which is the reason why, if you're a restaurant owner, being and investing in these QR codes and investing in your customers joining your social media platforms is key in getting you more notice, more touch point, and that is essentially is how you build trust for them to come back again and again. As we dive deeper into the rabbit hole of how you can market with QR codes, we have realized that you can actually have coupons, coupons to display when you scan your phone on these QR codes. Now, how does that work, Wilson? Well, simply put, think about one thing. Brunch time, you wanna run a promotion, 20% off pancakes. And lunch time, you wanna run 10% off your pizzas. And then dinner time, 5% off your pasta. How are you gonna be able to distribute all these crazy coupons and how are you gonna be able to keep track of everything? It is very difficult to do so. But with QR codes, you can definitely do that. According to Q Restaurant, what you can do is simply have one QR code and you can set different times to show different coupons. And what that means is, for example, if this is a QR code and your customers come during the breakfast time, they scan this QR code you can actually show them 20% off the pancake. Now, you don't need to change this QR code. Lunchtime comes around, same customers come in, scan the same QR code. What's gonna show up on the phone would be a 10% off the pizza. If they come during dinner time, same QR code, same person scans the same QR code, you're gonna get 5% off your pasta. And this is something called the dynamic QR code, which you can set different types of offer that pops up at different times. And it is that powerful. What does that do? It allows you to run some creative campaigns at different times, and you can actually test out different things without having to print out multiple different offers, without having to be confused about what is happening and what what is shown on people's phone. All you have to do is to be able to manage that in the back end. And Q Restaurant allows the capability for you to create this type of campaign. And I know you might actually have been burnt with running thousands of dollars on radio ads, on Facebook ads, on all these crazy initiatives, which at the end of the day, you have no way of showing what was your return on investment. Well, with Q Restaurant, you actually have the data all behind the scenes. 
whether you want to be able to run a campaign on discounts or you want to be able to run a campaign on getting more reviews or just a campaign driving people to your Instagram. You're going to be able to track all of those in the back end through Q restaurants and which is the reason why there's such a powerful tool at a very, very affordable price. I even reached out to them to offer you guys a 30 day risk free all guaranteed trial for you and once again i really really highly recommend that you guys check them out in the link below it's completely free for the first month so then that way you can see whether it is something that is suitable for your needs i hope you enjoyed this video qr codes is the future of restaurant industry and in restaurant marketing whether you go with this or that it is still super super important for you guys to check it out I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys in the next video.